It's pirate season again, and we're not talking about those pirates. No, we're talking about porch pirates that want to spoil your holiday online shopping. And new this morning, John Shumway is here with ideas on how to protect your packages. And you know what? I see them up and down yep. the street in my neighborhood, you know, packages on everybody's doorsteps. Yeah, and you're not the only one seeing them. This is happening more and more. And according to research firm CNR, one in seven of us have been victimized this year, and most of us know someone who's lost a package or two. They take delivery of your package before you can. This is a crime of opportunity. Video doorbells are catching more and more of the pirates in the act, and they can actually act as a deterrent, but you are your own best line of defense. Access the delivery service online like UPS My Choice and tell them where to put the package. And have whoever it is put it on a back porch or a side porch or maybe by a garage door if that's a little more hidden from view. Which may stop the delivery spot and grab pirates, but not those that follow the trucks. Detective Sergeant Brian Kohlhepp of Ross Township says work together with your neighbors. If you have someone who's retired or works from home or stays at home that you can have communication with, and even better, if you can get them to retrieve the package when it comes and put it somewhere safe. Or you can use an alternative delivery location like Amazon's boxes or the UPS stores. Or FedEx uses some Walgreens and Dollar General locations where you can go pick up your package. Now the key is find out who is delivering your package and set up where you want it to be delivered and then make sure that you track it so you know when it's there, especially track it if it's coming to your home. Yeah, it almost sounds like we need a neighborhood watch program just to protect our packages. Like, John, you've got one on your porch. Yeah, actually, you're right on the money, David. When porch pirates are caught, often it's because an alert neighbor actually sees it happen and then calls in the license number on the car. But the key there is to be alert to what's going on in your neighborhood, especially if you see somebody following the truck. Oh yeah. my gosh, yeah. That's awful. And I, when I see packages on porches, I automatically think, oh, I hope they're going to get it quick. It makes me think someone might go and swipe it because you just never know, and it happens so fast. Yeah, and it's just sitting there waiting. Exactly. All right, great advice. Thank you, John.